Hey everyone, welcome back to another video on Alien Invasion. In the last video, I had shown you the new three resources, which are basically chemical, nut, and another green chemical. So yeah, like purple, uh, nuts, and another green uh, chemical. I'll exactly what are the names? I'll just show you in a short while. Before that, let's just go ahead and. Well, basically, these are the factories I shown you last time. We'll be moving ahead to the next part of this game, where we'll, I'll be showing you other three L new elements which have been unlocked for us now. Right? So you cross this level, which is after level 13. You move over here, and we find a new shop, which is James' shop. So here it is. Uh, we get this uh, bronze color square. That's not a square. That's uh, I forgot the name. Okay, let's go with square and That's the pentagon silver pentagon and golden hexagon. So these elements are now used to Improve the droppings of such elements and then you can use them to upgrade your cargo capacity catching speed and HP So I'm uh, one by one with use of different resources and then there's green essence income red essence and purple essence that's basically the bronze silver and gold which were named previously in those six farms in the winter area after that we get to bake efficiency factory efficiency and chemical plant efficiency bake efficiency equals that purple chemical purple element or purple chemical okay so basically the conversion that we do as and when you increase your bake efficiency as i have 25 percentage my conversion rate changes from 100 to 125 that is if you use 100 chemical points it will be changed to 125 rather than usual 100 similarly for factory the nuts changes to 118 instead of 100 and well I have not upgraded anything chemical plant efficiency because I don't have the gold resource as of now so the three names are nanofiber servos and wire well, you can go ahead with that or we can go ahead with purple chemical nuts and green chemical okay so these are the three i have upgraded my nano fiber to a good level so basically as and when uh we you know collect those purple chemicals i get a good drop of extra 46 percentage and also the bonus from the factory levels plus the double bonus resource from you know metal shop so it's actually pretty much helpful okay so as i said you guys in the last video do not use your gems as of now but for the james's shop you will have to use it and i'll show you in a short while for now let's just upgrade as much resource i have okay and again i'm really sorry guys it will take me a lot of time to upgrade all these things and you know give you a full view of what the current status of my game would be but it will take me a lot of time for that but still I'll try to keep improving as fast as and as quickly as possible so that you guys can also enjoy the game so first these guys will be unlocked and you'll be getting a meager of maybe 5-10 bronze coins and well you just need to keep collecting them and then improving from here you can use this to you know get a top up from using the gems but use only 100 gems and not 500 gems you can see that <clears throat> there's a difference in you know using 100 and 500 basically if you use 100 gems five times you should be getting around 36.5 million but rather than that you get 43.9 million but that's not the thing here the thing is once you use 7.3 billion immediately in upgrading your drop rate that 7.39 billion will be exponentially increased when you use it the next time to gain other top up with the use of 100 gems give me some time while i collect another 41 gems and then show you what i'm actually meaning with that okay till then let's just let me just show you where we can go so this is the first place where you'll be collecting make sure you upgraded your metal shop because you know doubling resources and getting will be very much helpful and then you can go here this is the second unit this is the third unit they start attacking you the fourth unit do not attack you and you'll start getting the silver element okay again a silver element which is also good i currently get 12,000 silver element from them and here is the bonus these black suited guys are back and they hit you very hard i get 5.97 million 
bronze coins from them, bronze element. And from these guys I get 1.98 million silver coins, silver elements. Okay. Now the next one would be for me is to unlock this, which is using 8 billion silver, which is going to be a lot actually. And then there is 40,000 gold coins. I cannot tap and you know just purchase the topper because that's not an available option as of now okay now uh, regarding the update upgrades make sure you only and only focus on the bronze coins bronze elements for now the first focus should only and only be on bronze keep on upgrading that as much as possible and keep on unlocking these units one two these two okay and this third one this third one will start giving you silver coins. Once you start getting that, then you can focus on silver and bronze at the same time. All right. And make sure you use your gems because it will be very hard for you to reach at this level without the usage of gems. Mm, you know, it's okay to use gems. Either you can purchase them if you have, if you want to. It's totally up to you. I have not purchased any gems as of now. I have not spent any money. But I have spent a lot and a lot of time on this game. So it's totally up to a person's perspective whether you want to spend or you want to, you know, just spend your time or spend your money. It's totally up to you. Alright, so focus totally on your drop rate. Once you get a little bit cozy with that, uh, cargo is definitely not needed right now. Neither catching speed nor HP. Green, red and purple essence. Do not spend a single element on this. It's really of no use. I mean, like, I have already almost maxed out all my six farms and it's really of no use for me. Unless, once we reach level 15, they show us something totally different, which I don't know. This this level 15 will be, I mean, really an eye-opener. We are going to see the final boss of uh, Winter Area. So, that's going to be fun. Alright, so next upgrade. Uh, no essence. Bake efficiency. Once you're a little bit settled with the upgrades from drop rate, move on to bake efficiency because that will definitely be helpful for you in the factories. You can upgrade bake efficiency and factory efficiency as per your own choice, how much ever you like. It's totally up to you. So that's okay. If you're finding trouble to you know collect elements, then you can go ahead with nanofiber drop. That is also very helpful. Nanofiber and service drop. See, you can collect hundred of those flying hovers okay with one element each or you can collect just 20 with five element each correct so nanofiber drop rate increase increment will definitely be very helpful to save your time yeah but make sure you have upgraded a drop rate to a very good level where you're getting like one or two million easily without any issues so as you can see i get two million silver coins silver elements with just one guy and about six million bronze element without any trouble from single guy okay so uh let's skip ahead why uh, when i have 100 gems and i'll show you how much difference it makes when you you know go for a single 100 gem purchase and rather than a 500 gem purchase give me a little bit of time to just skip ahead okay all right guys so we are back with few gems and well i'll just show you once before we go ahead as you can see i can get 7.92 billion with 100 gems for you know bronze coins and 2.87 billion for silver coins let's go ahead i'll just purchase the silver coins for now okay i'll just show you how much we can get ahead with that so i get 2.87 billion okay and if we were supposed to go for 500 gems that would mean 17.2 billion okay so let's see uh, sorry it's 2.99 billion yeah i just now upgraded right so i should be getting 14.95 if i were to you know go for 100 gems five times but i could get 18 billion instead of 14.95 but i'll be showing you something which is even more amazing so let's go ahead and purchase 2.99 billion silver coins yep and now time to upgrade let's see how much we can upgrade now and time to wait we wait like maybe 5 to 10 seconds and then we can see the amount of upgrades that we actually receive rather than just 18 million 
and it's 4.51 so if I were to calculate this into 5 times so that is the first one we get 2.99 and now we can get 4.51 okay that is 7.5 correct even with that increasing maybe we get 6 billion after that and maybe 7 billion and then 8 billion that would still equal to 25 to 28 billion stating that I have not taken into account maybe the amount of increase that it might actually take rather than what I am thinking correct but as you can see instead of going for 500 gems it is definitely better for you guys to go for 100 gems upgrade top up and then go for all the upgrades how much ever you can because to be honest these upgrades are actually pretty effective and well again you still have to go for uh, you know 500 gems for this I can get 4.51 billion with my next top up maybe two more top up two or three more top ups and then I would definitely be getting about seven to eight million uh, eight billion uh, silver coins and I guess we'll be unlocking the golden droppers over here and that would be amazing so that we can unlock these last units two more new units to go and then we will be facing off the completion over here but i also do have to see that after level 15 what more do we unlock my next video will be on level 15 make sure you watch that out i'll be completing this today and um, this going into this path would be pretty awesome we'll be facing the final boss and that is going to be amazing i don't know how strong he, he is but that would be good to see and maybe uh i don't know what units uh this 35 billion golden hexagon coins will be unlocking i have no idea about that we have to see one by one how it goes ahead make sure you check out my new videos don't forget to subscribe share and like i'll be really glad if you guys can do that also so if you have any doubts regarding these upgrades or resources please free feel free to comment under my videos and i'll be happy to help you as soon as you get new upgrades make sure that you you know just focus on the drop rate if you maximize that out and then you can go ahead to the other upgrades rather than you know going ahead simultaneously my first focus for you guys would definitely be drop rate and then after some time you can go ahead with bake efficiency factory efficiency chemical plant efficiency nanofiber servos and wire drop but as i said first the first focus should be the drop rate of these coin elements rather than anything else don't forget that and i hope you enjoyed the game i would also prefer that you guys do not actually use hacks or anything because well you know where's the fun in that if you were just to complete the game within a day like why even play that game right i mean that's my choice but it's up to you guys uh, however you would like to prefer that so i hope you guys are doing okay in the current catch genie event i am not doing anything better because i just have 2.2 thousand and well that's nothing compared to how we require 20 thousand and i just have seven more days I won't be going ahead with that and of course I won't be purchasing anything and that's going to take I'll just try how much ever I can reach even if I were to reach uh, maybe top 5 positions I could get 1000 gems which is pretty good actually even for top 10 places 500 gems are nice whatever I can get because that would be pretty awesome ok so guys I'll see you later till then take care stay safe enjoy the game remember save your gems for these resources and check out my new video for level 15 i hope you enjoy this video and if you have any trouble if you have any problems with my videos or questions you can definitely ask i'll be happy to help you take care stay safe